Oh, we back at it, y'all. We back at it. What's going on, gang? Welcome back to the channel. Georgia Boy 706, y'all. Y'all new to the channel, y'all go on ahead and hit the subscribe button, the like button, check the bell for notifications. We finna goddamn crank it up, man. We finna try to keep this thing going, man. Try to crank it back up, y'all. Get the channel back up and going. I know I owe y'all an explanation on uh, the C10, man. Sierra, man. The last video I had dropped, I um, changed out the transmission from the uh, 350 to the 700 R4. And everything ain't go what I, I it didn't go as smooth as I thought it would, y'all. Um, the uh, transmission I bought it from a guy off a of, uh, Facebook Marketplace, and I don't know, man. It seemed like that transmission not changed it out. It seemed like it ain't changing out to me. Yep, it's going. Um, I'm I'm getting first, second, and third. It's going reverse and everything like that. Overdrive gear though. That overdrive gear is not changing out. So. What I'm finna do today is I'm finna pull this transmission again, y'all. Pull the transmission out again. And uh go ahead and take it to the transmission shop and get it rebuilt, man. That's gonna be my best option. So um headed to the store right now. But uh as soon as I get back, I'm gonna cut y'all back on. So we can go ahead and uh, move this car. Show y'all this new project that I got too. We can go ahead and get the Chevy, go ahead and get the C10 put in position so I can go ahead and snap the transmission. Now I gotta go get some gas for this uh for this new project, man. So y'all stay tuned, man. I'm all right, gang. I'm back at the crib. I got CC all crunk up. Just letting it warm up real quick, man. I'm gonna take around the block one more time before I decide on if I'm gonna snap the transmission back out. Because it might be a possibility that. Uh, my kick down cable wasn't um, adjusted properly, so I adjusted it properly. So though we're gonna do, I'm gonna take it on a little test run, and we're gonna see. I'm just letting it warm up real quick. We're gonna see y'all. We're gonna see what's going on. Let her do her thing on warm up, and I'm gonna drive around the block. I just hate that I stay over here, man, because it's traffic. This traffic be killing me. But we're gonna make do. We're gonna uh, test out one last time, man, before I decide on if I'm gonna take this transmission out and go on ahead and take it to the transmission shop and let it get uh, rebuilt, man. Because, like I said, uh, I just had bought this transmission off the of Facebook Marketplace. Dude assured me that, you know, wasn't that wrong with it, but you know how that go. So, um, yeah, man, I'm just gonna let this thing warm up and I'm gonna take y'all with me. We gonna test it. I wanna see if it's changing out, but like I said, I don't think it's changing out of third gear. I don't think it's changing out. Cut y'all back on when we get ready to pull off.
I know it got a warranty on it, and I know it's going to do its thing. Let me get this thing back to the house, man, so we can get a position up, so we can snap this thing. I'm in first now. Let's see. Second. Transmission man, so many people got all had got on that post and just was just giving me off the wall names that I know I wouldn't let rebuild my shit. You know what I'm saying? So I'm going to the shop with it, man. Y'all know I'm going to these doggone these professionals. I need a, a warranty, a receipt, I need all that. Ain't no taking it to somebody's house and you know what I'm saying? They gonna rebuild it for me. Nah man, come on man, I don't rock like that. Y'all know what's going on. But anyway, man, welcome back to the channel, man. Shoot, it's a new day. Y'all see, I'm on my way. I dropped the transmission yesterday. I ain't wanna, I ain't wanna, uh, I ain't even wanna, uh, record no footage of me doing it because, like I said, I already did a video of that. I right. already got a video. Use the left two lanes to turn onto US 80 West toward Chattahoochee Valley Community College. Repeating the 
same footage. So I just snatched that. It's in the back of the trunk. A black beauty, you know what I'm talking about? And we on our way. We on our way. It'll go drop off, so I should have it back. I should have it back like Wednesday, something like that. Hopefully. But yeah, man. I'm just giving y'all a little quick updates, man, here and there, man. But, uh. All right, gang. We back from the transmission shop. I got that transmission dropped out of them. They told me Monday it should be ready, so. We should be able to drive Project Sierra, man. We should be able to drive her next week. We should be able to drive her. Y'all know I'm gonna have footage of that. I'm gonna have to put that back in and everything, so. We should be good on her, man. We should be able to drive her. But uh, let me show y'all what I had going on yesterday. I'm trying to show y'all my new project. This is what I'm gonna be starting on next. I'm gonna be LS swapping it fine, y'all. Got the box at home. I'm gonna uh, wash it up. Just to see what's going on with it. I just wanna wash it up. Spray all this dust and dirt off of But uh, that's what we're gonna do, man. We're gonna go ahead and clean it up and see if we can get a back sparkly. Looking a little better than what she looking. But that's what I'm gonna be doing to it though. I'm gonna be uh, just doing an LS swap, 4L60. So yeah, let me take y'all along the way. Y'all already know. That thing looking good though. She already look good. What's up? Uh, yep, my brother had this car. I know y'all seen this car on another video. My brother had it. I got it from him. good in here man like it don't look too bad in here oh that look pretty good it only got 215,000 miles original miles on it on oh, dashboard not too bad but what I wanted to do was go ahead and just get all that redid anyway either find me another dashboard or get that on fiberglass so I can hide them cracks and stuff Got to get another headliner. See the headliner messed up. It fell. He just tore it on down, but it's there. All I got to do is um get it rewrapped. Yep, dope panels, all that stuff look good though. Yep, dope panels look pretty good. On to the back. Dope panels look pretty good. Like I said, I'm going to um, redo these dope panels. I'm going to dye them black. Do the whole inside black. Like my boy, um, my boy Southside Nate did. Take all these panels off and I'm going to redo them black. And seats, I'm going to just get my seats redid though. Yeah, that's the plan for it. Uh-huh. Yeah. That's what we're going to be doing to it, y'all. That's my plans going forward. Yes, sir. Time. Can't wait till that transmission come back for CC. So I can be on the road with oh, I need my truck. Y'all, I need my truck. I can't wait. As soon as that come back Monday, we're going to slap that in. And we're going to get started on the LS swap, man. I already got the motor. got the motor right here. Got my motor already. Start busting my motor down. Yeah, we're gonna go from there, man. Big things in store. I'm back. I'm back. I know I've been MIA, but shoot, I be having stuff going on, y'all. So y'all know how to go. When you ain't got it, them projects gonna sit. They gonna sit until you got it. So hey, we gonna crank it back up now. Y'all stay tuned, man. Stay locked in, Georgia Boy 706. Hit that like button, hit the subscribe button, hit the bell for notifications. We back. We back. Yep. I'm gonna wash it up. Clean it up a little bit. I was gonna um take this transmission. Since I'm doing the LS swap in the car anyway, what I was gonna do was 
I was gonna take this transmission and put it in my truck. But um, when I um, inspected up under the car, I noticed that this ain't no 700 R4 in this car. It's a 200, a 204R. And um, I already got my drive shaft, everything did for the truck to bolt up to a 700 R4. So I ain't want to go through all that again. I already got the stall and all that. I ain't want to go through all that again. So yeah, we just going to start fresh with the box. For now, but for now, Frank, she run good. Ain't nothing wrong with her. I just wanna um go ahead and do the LS swap to something, man. We ain't got but a 305 in it. I wanna go on and LS swap. Like I said though, man, this mug got original miles. 200,000 original miles on it. She ain't molested or nothing like that. Everything's still hooked. So when I go to doing my LS swap, I wanna label and tag every plug so I know what everything go to. And once I do that, it's gonna make the LS swap a whole lot easier for me. But yeah, that's what I got in store for her. So y'all stay tuned, man, stay tuned. But as for now, she crank and run, man. I drove this car home. Crunk it up. Drove it home. Straight like this. Yup. Put a little iron tire. Rim still got good little tire, little 24s on it, but y'all know we're gonna come better. But I drove it home just like this. Just like this. Drove it home just like this. Yes, sir. So I'm gonna go ahead and get the pressure washer out, man. Pressure wash this thing. I'm gonna clean it up a little bit, man. Y'all stay tuned. I don't know, gang. It look like it's gonna rain. But I'm still uh gonna crank that thing up for y'all. Still gonna crank it up for y'all. It look like it's gonna rain. Oh. She a good car, man, like I said, man, but this gonna be the better candidate for the LS swap. I definitely want an LS swap there. We gonna let the Camaro stay like that. So he ready to do something with it, but I'm gonna go ahead and let's swap this out. Y'all know what's going on next with this. Everything original. Ain't nothing at all wrong with him. Everything original. 305. Uh, uh 200 on our transmission.
ain't nothing wrong with this car, man. I want to drive it like this. I don't, I slick don't want to clean it up yet because if I clean it up, shoot, I'm going to be motivated to drive it just like this. Ain't nothing wrong with it. Ain't nothing wrong with it. Shoot, I've been working on my truck for the longest. I ain't got that right yet. You know what I'm saying? Don't I was going to take the transmission out of this and put it in the truck, but nah. I already got a 700 in the truck, man. So I'm going to keep this in here. Nothing wrong with her, y'all. I mean, ain't nothing wrong with her, man. Drive her to the A and back. Ain't nothing wrong with her. Yes, sir. We're going to LS swap this guy, y'all. Yeah, I know what's going on. We're going to LS swap this. You got to. I already got these right here. I already showed y'all. I got them right there already. Put all that on tomorrow, man. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna pressure wash it, and I'm gonna put those on. I'm gonna try to see if I can put them bumper fillers in, in tomorrow. That's what we gonna do? Clean it up, vacuum it out, wash it up. I just want to put no bumper fillings in just for not. I ain't gonna even tear it down yet because I'm still able to move it around and stuff in my yard. You know what I'm saying? So right now, yeah. We're gonna leave her alone until I'm done doing this LS swap. And when I'm done doing the I mean uh I'm gonna leave it alone until I'm done doing the uh the uh rebuild on the LS motor. And when I'm ready to I'm ready to drop the LS motor in, then that's when I'm gonna take the motor out. I ain't in no hurry. I ain't in no hurry. We done already took the transmission for uh, Sierra to the shop today to get rebuilt. So I'm definitely not in no hurry. I want that on the road. Y'all already know it's been a long time coming. Oh, I know it's been a long time coming for Sierra. So I ain't in no hurry. Like I said, I already got the LS ready to dog gonna get broke down for the box. I just been doing my research and stuff like that to figure out what exactly I need to do with everything I, I, I need to do it with, what parts I need. And it going down, y'all. Y'all know it. Georgia Bus 706. Y'all better uh, hit that subscribe button. Yep. Like I said, I already dropped transmission off of that. I'm good to go. I'm waiting. LS for uh, for the box. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? I'm waiting. I'm ready to tear it down. Got another LS in this truck right here. I'm finna take the LS up out of him too. Got the transmission gone in this truck right here. So, shit. So we finna take the LS up out of it. I'm gonna take the transmission out of it too. And I'm gonna keep it though. Just gonna keep it. It's a two wheel drive, 4L60. I'm gonna keep it. Rebuild that. That's what we gonna put in the box. We gonna put the transmission up out of there and we gonna build our own LS. So y'all stay tuned for that too. Yes, sir. I ain't my baby dog on back up under the dog on table. Mm. Mm -mm. She back in surgery again. That's all right. She be right. She be right. Yes, sir. I got the box Chevy truck. Box Chevy car. Not playing. <laughs> That's my fleet right there. Black Beauty out there. Chilling. Yep. Not playing, y'all. Not playing. Ain't nothing wrong with this car. But um, I'm gonna end the video right here, y'all, man. Y'all just stay tuned, man. I'm gonna um drop another video tomorrow, boy. Yep. Yep. Video probably short, y'all, but I'm gonna end it right here, man. Like I said, on tomorrow, I'm gonna start cleaning it out and I'm gonna pressure water. That's gonna be in a whole nother video. I'm gonna do just a whole video of me cleaning up this whole doggone car, man. But, um, appreciate y'all, man. If y'all watch the video to the end, y'all, um, hit the like button, subscribe if y'all did, you know what I'm saying? Hit the bell for notification, man. I'm gonna see y'all back at it. Georgia Bus 706. All right.